Welcome to Tax 1099. Hey guys, I am here to give you a little bit of instruction to complete your import from QuickBooks Desktop to Tax 1099. The method we're going to use today is the plug-in. First, we want to get our vendor information in order. So we'll go to the print file screen after a few screens inside QuickBooks. I'm going to use the NEC, so we'll get started here. If everything's good on these screens, you'll just click continue. You don't have to look at these payments unless you want to. All right, as long as you have some compensation here with your total equals here, and this is zero because this is unmapped payments, you can click continue. All right, from here you do the e-file service, but we're just gonna save and close on this screen. Now we're going to upload our information on this bottom box. Okay, you put in your email and password information from the Tax 1099 website on the account that you've already registered in. Make sure your export year and the form that you want is correct in these boxes. All right, this is indicated that it's uploading, that little quick screen that you saw. And these are the indications that your forms have properly imported over to the screen. You want green dots, but if you do have red dots, it's usually something that's simple and that you can complete and edit inside the website. But that's basically it. Your forms have been imported. Uh, you guys have a good day. Hope you found this helpful. Thanks for watching.